everyone, this is Sorry and Target welcoming you back to our next episode of Primal Prey. This is episode, um, I don't know, is it 13? I think it's 13. If someone's keeping up with this, remind me. I think, I think it's 13. Anyway, what we're doing today is something really exciting, and I have totally spoiled it by clicking on Hunt already, so we're going to go back here, and I'm going to tell you guys what we're not doing. We're not going to hunt Troodon. It's not going to be at night. It's going to be fun, potentially, so long as the game doesn't break, and I'm really excited to do it. We have been hunting Iguanodon and Troodon at night like lunatics for who knows how long. I'm sick of it at this point, and as you can see, I haven't gotten this third star multi-species multi-kill or in our trophy hunts for the Troodon, Iguanodon, nighttime, garbage, whatever. We're done with that. We're moving on to bigger and better things, and those bigger and better things are... There's <laughs> Quetzalcoatlus. Hunting pterosaurs is something people have wanted to see in carnivores for a long time. Hasn't made it in there yet. So that's one thing Primal Prey does have over carnivores. It does have huntable pterosaurs. And that's what we're going to be doing today with our first mission, Arrow Research. Airvan, an airplane manufacturer, is interested in flying reptile research. They are mostly interested in the flight characteristics of flying reptiles for their new line of aircraft. You are to kill a large male or female Quetzalcoatlus. Start time, 6 in the afternoon, pays $1,300. Alright, sounds like a pretty good gig to me. So, let's see, complete, no, 250 pounds. That, hmm, I don't know how easy that's going to be to get. I don't really remember much about hunting Quetzalcoatlus. I remember they nosedive at you. Uh, that's about it. My memory's a little foggy on that. So, let's see what we got here. Two minutes. Good okay, well, let's hop right into it then. Let's see, um, I don't remember a lot about hunting Quetzalcoatlus. I know we will not need you, so we're gonna click that off. We'll take the call box. I don't really think we need much else as far as equipment goes. I do remember hunting them with the shotgun. I feel like, you know, bird shot, bird-ish flying things. There's a correlation there, I promise, somewhere. I feel like the shotgun's pretty effective, especially when they get really close. But just in case, I think we're gonna bring our electron gun. How is it? We have the sonic blaster too. That might be a little bit better, just for hitting, you know, those wide shots, because I can imagine hitting something as thin as a pterosaur is gonna be a little tricky with a lightning bolt. The sonic blaster covers more range, and if we die and lose it, it's not that big of a loss. So, I think we're gonna go with the shotgun sonic blaster combo. All right, Quetzalcoatlus. Let's see how this goes. Golly, that sun is bright. Okay, so now we got to keep our eyes peeled on the sky as well as the ground because, you know, throw it on, Utah Raptors. This place is not herbivore friendly. Good grief! You can't you can't look in that direction at all. I don't know what the spawn rate is in Primal Prey for dinosaurs that you have selected versus dinosaurs you don't have selected. I feel like certain ones like Styracosaurus always spawn, but others that you may or may not be hunting, I feel like it's almost random. Because this area is not very big, and I'm pretty sure I have explored its entirety before and not seen a dinosaur that I had selected. A little bit of lag there. So maybe we'll find a Quetzalcoatlus, maybe we won't. I'm honestly not too sure how this hunt's gonna go, especially if the frame rate keeps crapping on itself. <laughs> oh! Yeah, the spooky devil. Oh, frick. I really didn't want to do this! Whew. Oh. Something else is coming at me. Oh my gosh! <laughs> that was not pleasant in the slightest. Okay, this sh should be doable. I missed? How do you miss with a sonic blaster? I'm shooting sound at him. It's, it's kind of hard to miss. Okay, there we go. Good hit. Good hit. Good hit. Oh, yeah, yeah, you don't like that. I like to imagine the Sonic Blaster is playing, like, really loud rock music, like, heavy death metal stuff. Yes? Oh. I think... Oh. I thought it might have died. Whew. Okay, so she's still up. I feel like the male went down. I heard him do a little screechy screech. I didn't... Might have fallen over. I got three hits on him. That's two on her. Where in the heck did she go? Ooh, I saw that. I saw that. 
I see you over there. Let's see. Yeah, he went down. All right. Utah Raptor, is he stunned? He is stunned. With that lovely tail twitching sleeping animation going on. And I have yet to see a single Quetzalcoatlus. I don't know how high up I'm supposed to be looking. Like, will, will this suffice? Do I have to do it like this? Because then I can't see the ground in front. <gasps> Alberto is hero. All right. No! No! <laughs> oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> not the T-Rex. Not the T-Rex. Please, not the T-Rex. Oh, Surprise, mother... No! Crud, 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 crud. <laughs> Primal Prey, I hate you. So, if, if I lose, if I lose anything, holy crap, that was close. Oh, Primal Prey! Okay, not gonna lie, I uh, kind of forgot about the T-Rex. That's um, going to be an issue. T-Rex is incredibly hard to kill. I have two weapons that are not designed for killing T-Rex. And this might be another nightmare. Wallpaper. I feel like it's not. I feel like it's. <gasps> oh, I see you. I see you over there. I see you over there. I bet you come over here. Yeah. Come to me. It's... No! Where? Where, 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 where? I'm so done with you. I am so done with you. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Two, two males. I'm a female! Okay. Got some kinky relationship going on here, boys. I don't like that at all. Are they done? What's 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 close? I hear something right behind me. Are you guys done? What's what's going on here? Give me give me a sign. What are we doing? I'm just gonna play it crazy. I, I, <laughs> the AI in this game is like bizarre. I had I had someone explain to me though. That, ooh, I thought that was a Quetzalcoatlus. <laughs> um, yeah, I had someone telling me the other day, or not the other day, this was a while back, that the AI in this game is like actually really detailed and like super intricate. Like if you shoot, oh my gosh, this is so stupid. Hang on, where's where's the time portal? I'm not putting up with this much longer. I can't even get to the time portal. Okay, I've got them all facing the same direction. There we go. There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get up out. Get up out. Don't want none of this. Five finger death punch. Corn. Other. Oh, I think I got him. Oh, it's overheated. Dead gummit. No T Rex. No T Rex. Okay. I'm gonna try that call box again because I saw the freaking thing. Just flew off into the sunset like it was riding. Am I crouched? <gasps> no! Uh, if it's just one. Oh, it's a male too. Look at that blue on his neck. Oh, that's super good. I adore. Okay, look, guys, I cannot do Utah Raptor and T Rex. <laughs> he took the bullet for him. <laughs> that was really funny. Oh, shoot, there's quicksand right there. <gasps> Am I gonna do it? Did I do it? I got a T Rex! I got a freaking T Rex! Hold up, hold up. I'm gonna die. I don't care. I gotta get screenshot to this. This is amazing. I got a T Rex. I got a. Freaking T Rex. Do you, I'm on like cloud nine right now. Where those Quetzalcoatlus at? I'll fly with you guys. Let's go, Utah Raptor. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. What you got? What you got? Where you at? Where you at? Yeah. You think you're tough? You think you're tough? You think you're tough? Look at you. I LOL at you. LOL, you try and push your claws. I don't think so, boys and girls. You guys can step on back. Yeah. Don't want none, none, don't want none of this. Let's go. Oh! Oh, she just about. No, 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 no. That's right. That's right. Where are you? Where did you go? If I could. It's really hard to shoot freaking death metal bands at you. Who's in the water? What's in the water? Where? Okay. 
Well, this has been exciting. Where's my freaking T-Rex? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Over here. Over here. Oh, look at that. Okay, I've got a great idea for a shot. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Look at that. That's freaking Saurian. That's freaking Saurian's. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Guys, I'm so excited right now. I got a T-Rex. I got a T-Rex. Oh, that's amazing. Look at this bad boy. Look at this bad boy. Oh, eat it up. Yeah, yeah, I saw the bird, but this, I got a T-Rex, and it wasn't even that hard, honestly. Oh, I'm afraid I'm about to get, like, destroyed by these things. Okay, let's call this. Let's see. Is this going to work? Oh, oh, he's hit. He's going in. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, my gosh. Oh, got him. Got him. What the heck do you mean I can't claim this? Shut up, Primal Prey. You cannot tell me what to do. As soon as vision ended, we the portal to return home. We did it! <laughs> we got a T-Rex too. Forget the Quetzalcoatlus, guys. I got a freaking T-Rex. How cool is that? I am the master of the sea. <laughs> I got a T-Rex. I cannot Forget the Quetzalcoatlus. Forget that Quetzalcoatlus. Guys, I got a freaking T-Rex. Freaking T-Rex in Primal Prey. Oh my goodness. That is like my second T-Rex ever. I, when I was playing through this the first time, when I finally got it to work, I got a T-Rex female for the trophy room. And that was like, yeah, that was huge. And I'm like, I got a male. I got another T-Rex. I have completed the T-Rex sexes. T-Sex. Here we go. I don't even know what I'm saying at this point. All right. Error research. Pff, done. Completed. Whatever. Not even good. Let's try our random hunt. <laughs> I got a T-Rex. All right. Boreasi and Quillet requires a live male and female Triceratops to conduct experiments. Start time 6 in the afternoon, pays $3,000. That might actually be a pretty good one. We get to see Quetzalcoatlus, Triceratops, those are the two um, primary animals for this episode 3 string of missions. And maybe we get another um, T-Rex, who knows? I just got off that mission. Dead gummit. I was going to show some pictures. Uh, let's see what we got here. And we just did Quetzalcoatlus. Dead male Triceratops to study endocrinology. Start time 6. This this will be good. Yeah, just one Triceratops. Think it'll be fine. Let's see. Um, I think I'm going to bring the Electron gun. I just feel safer with it. Even though the Sonic Blaster worked really well last time. You know, it did work really well, didn't it? No, screw it. We're going to bring the Sonic Blaster. I'm going to leave the call box. To, I, I forget if you can lose equipment if you die. And I just, I, I can't run that risk. I... And when I saw the T-Rex, all those memories of the last episode came flooding back to me. There's just T-Rex, T-Rex, T-Rex. I lost the whatever weapon we lost, had to buy back. I don't want to go through that again. So we're just going to pack this shotgun, sonic blaster, same as last time. Dead male Triceratops. Here we go. Let's get it on. All right, say, ooh, hello. Oh, if it isn't the glitchiest dinosaur in the freaking game. You suck, Aladar. And here we have our first one. Hello, delicious. Come to Papa. My life is like a never-ending... I really like that roar. Really low rumble. Oh, yeah, look at you. Whoa, whoa, hold up, hold up. What was that all about? No, -uh, you don't get off that easy, lady. Oh, that's so cool. The, like, those are obviously, like... Where the heck is my sonic blaster? Away. Tway with it. Tway with it. Yeah, those are obviously just edited lion roars, but oh, they sound so good coming out of that Triceratops. The Primal Prey Triceratops looks phenomenal. Like, I know Todd Marshall's style, you either love it or hate it. I think he did really well with these dinosaurs, and especially the Triceratops. It looks so good. Now, I saw another one running off back here, and, aha, I have found it again. And is it a male? I believe it is. I'm not sure, though. I No, it's not. It, it's a female. Hmm. Well, that's the only Triceratops I saw besides that other one. Unless there's another one just hidden in the map somewhere. It's, it's kind of hard to tell. Uh, the males have red on the frill. 
Polo. Where did you go? God, these dinosaurs are weird. Uh, the male has red on the frill, and I think it's got some dark stripes on the rest of the body. I'm not too sure. Oh, yeah, FYI, there's a volcano. Oh, <gasps> oh my goodness, you guys scared the living daylights out of me. Just gonna start working our way into some um, better environments. Don't really wanna tackle a Utah Raptor in the mountains. Okay, I think we've got it nice and open now. There's one, there's two. And three is dragging up the rear. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's a sudden direction change. Okay, let's see here. Come on, instincts. Come back to me. Let's fight off these Utah Raptors. Oh, that's it. Nice, nice, nice. They'll be back. So if I can finish you off, that'd be one less thing to worry about. That was, that, that was a hit, maybe? These are hits, but I don't know if the sound wave is actually reaching her. Hey, gum at Triceratops. It was a dead. Aha. Now, what kind of Triceratops are you? Female. You're very aggressive, I see. Well, I too can be aggressive. Oh, male. Male Triceratops. Male Triceratops. I saw him. Alright, alright. Here we go. Here we go. I can't tell if she's behind me or not. Oh, good hit. Alright, we got some good hits in there. Oh, he stopped. For what did you stop, Sir Triceratops? Was it? Did you die? Oh, <laughs> that didn't work like I thought it would. Oh, oh, yikes. <gasps> got him, got him, got him, got him. Nice, 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 nice. I don't think you met the weight requirement, but who cares? We gotta go. Anyway, alright guys, we did it. Triceratops El Dunzo, 1500 bucks. I will take it. All right, guys, so we got to show off Quetzalcoatlus, uh, a Tyrannosaurus, of course, and Triceratops all in this episode. Um, I'll probably work on aero research, getting those stars, you know, in my own spare time, as well as the stars for a multi species multi kill, because that's the only other one we're lacking from back there. What do I need on that, by the way? The weight. Ugh, the weight is just. Oh, because you. Sometimes Primal Prey lets you take the dinosaurs you want, sometimes it doesn't. It's just like, no, you can't take that. Why? I don't know, because I said, I'm Primal Prey and I suck. So, <laughs> you can't just like go through my method of just killing every dinosaur on the map that you can, and then cherry picking your options, because also, in addition to not letting you take what you want, sometimes a carnivore comes along and eats your biggest kill. Like, say you kill a dinosaur, you're like, mm, that one's good, I'm gonna check the others and come back later. No, nah, it'll be a corpse by the time you get back, and you can't bring that back with you to the future. So, uh, that's gonna be really tough, I'll work on it in the meantime. Next episode, we'll be covering Triceratops again. St oh, midnight, are you kidding? I thought we were done with this. Why does Primal Prey feel the need to shove Midnight down my throat? I don't want it! It's an awful time to hunt. Let's see. Okay, Triceratops Wager. Uh, noon. Six. Eight. Okay. Uh, midnight. it! We have at least two more Midnight Hunts. And they're both Triceratops. Triceratops multi-kill. Is there a Lambiosaurus multi-kill? Oh my gosh, the Primal Prey people were as lazy as Tatum. <laughs> let's, use, let's, let's use the same name for everything. That'll be fine. Anyway, next mission, Triceratops Wager. Hopefully midnight's not too bad. I don't want to have to pull out night vision again, but you know Whatever we'll get through it. We're on to bigger better dinosaurs We're over halfway through primal prey so I can finally review it Thank you guys so much for watching for sticking with me as I suffer through primal prey. It's a love-hate relationship I love primal prey. I hate primal prey uh, a lot of you guys want to see it I, It's surprising how many people have never heard of primal prey who you know associate with me here on the channel it's, it's interesting so I hope this is kind of broadening your horizons to the more obscure dinosaur games that came out or at least you know the very few that I covered anyway thank you guys so much for watching be sure to leave down in the comments what's your favorite primal prey dinosaur for real Todd Marshall did a great job I think uh, his dinosaurs are incredibly well designed very stylistic very fitting for a game that's trying to stand out from carnivores uh, I'm all for it. This intro, this outro is taking way too long. Thank you guys for watching. You are all the best, and I will see you guys next time.
Hello everyone, thank you so much for watching. I genuinely appreciate it and I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you do enjoy the carnivores games and carnivores content on YouTube and want to help support this channel, you can do so at patreon.com slash sorryandtarget. There's a link down below in the description of this video. As many of you guys know, this YouTube channel is not my job and it takes a lot of my time to work on videos. But I love doing it for you guys, and every little bit donated helps me dedicate more time to making you guys the best carnivores content on YouTube. Thank you all for everything you do. I love you all, you are all the best. And I will see you guys next time.